Boop. <laughs> We can get through this. <laughs> be able to get through another session of Twilight Princess HD. Hey, hey, hey guys, uh, we're, gonna able, we're gonna be able to do this. Welcome back. Um, we're, uh... <laughs> All right, guys, sit back and relax. We're having another Twilight Princess HD Welcome session. Back, everybody, it's Casey's gonna be most... just as good as the last one. <laughs> Quote Casey, like 15 seconds before recording, no one yell. I have a headache. I'm sorry. <laughs> I have a headache. <laughs> I just thought that was like important Welcome enough to Welcome back to, to Casey's emphasize. most wanted to replay series on the channel again. I can't wait. This is actually really cool. I like this. We've never we've never used the Zora armor. Oh, no, you already yeah, have the iron boots, so you can use. Oh, okay. Yeah, we like. I like that they give you everything. Yeah. To to traverse underwater in a good way. I yeah. appreciate that. Also, yeah. everyone, if you notice any weird audio nonsense, that is because we are recording in a new location yeah. for the very first time. Which, this is default for Rohive for like a while. Yes. Which is pretty cool. Um, it's also new. <laughs> yeah. All right, cool. Uh, Ellie's uh, deflating. It's also New Year's Eve uh, that we're. Recording. It is New Year's. <laughs> Welcome <laughs> back to Ukulele Two Electric Boogaloo. Fuck off. <laughs> Can we just call this? Yeah, fucking Twilight Princess HD episode twenty-eight Ukulele. <laughs> <laughs> no wait, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, you guys entertain for a second. I need to think. I need to. Sit, fucking taste it. Look, it's a rock! I'm not gonna say I'm it. Gonna blow up the rock. <laughs> I'm gonna blow up the rock! I'm gonna blow up the rock! I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna fucking do it. I'll fucking, I'll fucking do it again. I'll fucking do it again. You're gonna have cut out all of this. Welcome back to... <laughs> welcome back to... Twilight Princess HD episode 28. Named Ukulele episode 9. There you go. That's okay, all that, it was. You were looking... Okay. Uh, where are we going, Ellie? Oh! This is the water temple. Oh, it's just here. Yes. Oh. Wow, we oh, just yeah. dead ass already The one clownman was talking about uh, how we he can't enter the the temple, but why would a clownman oh, ever need to enter a temple? Why? Remember remember clownman was saying like, he was like- I believe his name is Falby. So, so clownman was saying, he was, he was saying, he was like, ah, well I can't- why, why do they make it so why humans can't enter, and enter it? Well, the only reason we can enter is because... Wait, what? You gotta do it a little closer. It, it nope. has never failed me before. I'm confused. Fucking put it closer to the rock. Closer to the wall. Listen. Listen here, you little shit. Yeah? If this works. It's gonna work. It's I gonna know work. it's gonna work. Of course wow, it works. incredible. <laughs> I, uh... I don't know how I you could have figured out. Sorry. Let's go in the funny, funny temple. I'm actually. Let's go in the tomb. <laughs> the funny, Let's funny. go in the tomb. <laughs> I'm actually looking Welcome forward to this drive. temple. Down the tube. I once. Oh. I, I heard that this is a very well designed temple, and I'm I am like also it. looking it's forward to the. Boss. I have like no knowledge of what this temple looks like, and this is already cool as I shit. I like the large barnacles. I will just let you know that this one might take longer than the other ones, because no matter how many times I do this temple, I still always get lost at least one That's or two That's fine. Points. This does look incredible. Look at this the jellies. Like... Bye, jellies. Fuck you. I know Maybe. I compare everything to Subnautica, but this is like Subnautica. It is no longer like Subnautica, but... Lake bed. bed. That's what it's called. It, that's such a good name. Could the whole dungeon have just been that one thing, though, like, for, like, the whole time? No. No. <laughs> okay. No, I, I like, like I said, I'm pretty sure this temple does like pretty interesting things. Okay, going with the keep them with Choo the water theme. Choo-choo's are so lame in this game. Keep them. No. Keep them with like the water so theme. I was gonna say we have sea cucumbers, but I guess Chris doesn't fucking like them. But I'm yeah, sorry, you know, no, it's, fine. it's fine. Yeah. Um, no, no, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Like Chris, it's, it's, it's sometimes. Just I gotta, like sea cucumbers. Yeah, I'm sorry. No, I just like I like yeah, when the choo-choo's no, 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 you just don't like them. It's fucking. Fine. It is a fine. big boy. <laughs> it's so oh, much larger oh, yeah. than I thought it would be. My favorite part is that the, I think it's up to. Oh, oh my God, Link. There's the uh, the the one insignia from. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. That's the Zoro's sapphire. It's either. What is that? Oh. It's up oh. to five or six of the choo choos can combine and make one giant sea cucumber. It's Good. Great. Good, and I want to see that. <laughs> we will. Well, we, we should do it. Yeah, when we go into the slime temple, we'll see it. <laughs> no, I'm I can't the wait. Slime. There, there is a... 
There's the Cave of Ordeals later, which I figure we could do in, like, a spin-off episode. Do we have to do that to beat the game? No. Okay. That's why I'm saying, like, yeah, we don't have to do it, but um, there is an entire room dedicated to choo choo choos. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, cer you certainly do have a voice of character in this series. <clears throat> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that's all. <laughs> I think that's all. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> you know? <laughs> Don't you think you ought to knock down those stalactites hanging off the ceiling first? How does she know what stalactites are? Are there stalactites in the twilight? They don't look Probably. to be very stable. I bet they break pretty easily if you hit them with enough force, don't you think? Maybe if you use some bombs! From Barnes is Barnes! Is that Larion down there? Is that no, that looks like bug. Larion. What the fuck is Larion? Aaron's evolution. Agron's middle evolution. Oh! Look at it! Look at it down there! It does look like that, that actually. Like, a lot like that, actually. It's Larion. <laughs> that is, <laughs> honestly, that is like a very out of context thing to hear from a. Uh, well, that's all. I didn't think I never even pronounced it that way. There's the Tektites. Yeah, they look cool in this game. They kind of look like the guardian, like the scout guardians from Breath of the Wild. They look the like, uh, huh? They just look like uh, HD versions of the ones from uh, the original. Yeah, which is cool as fuck. From well, uh, from what was it called? The one on the N64. Ocarina. Ocarina of Time. Are they in Ocarina of Time? Yeah, they're on Death Mountain, huh. and in the Water Temple. Neato. Incredible. That is, uh, I don't know. Neato. Man. That game's pretty so good. Neat. That like. No, this bro, game. We're gonna play through. We're gonna play Ocarina of Time at some point. We will. We'll play we a bunch play of Zelda, Zelda games. games at one point. Yeah. I was gonna say, like, I wanted to gush on for a second. Uh, Age of Calamity has come out recently, and I oh, yes. fucking adore it. But I was gonna say, like, do you want to do Age of Calamity on live? We could. The, we could. As like kind of a setup to <laughs> one of the first series on this channel. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll we, play we it for could. two episodes and then never do it again. I know we can do that uh, if you want as like a prequel to oh, playing Breath of the Wild too. If you want. Oh yeah. Because that would that would it's make it chronological. Together. It's all coming together. I hate the Lazalfos in this game. Yeah, I did notice that that was a Lazalfos. Lazalfos in. Have you ever seen the comparison that people made from the Lazalfos artwork in Ocarina of Time and what it actually looks like in the game? No. Yes. Put it up, Casey. Okay, okay bring up the oh concept God. artwork. Just the, that's then... just the official artwork of a Lazalfos. That's what it looks like in the game. <laughs> there it is. so funny. <laughs> there, it, there it is. I remember they made really funny sounds. <laughs> <laughs> I've never, I haven't really played Ocarina. I don't know if that's what they do, but I like it. <laughs> Bow! 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 Like, <laughs> that's what she liked to imagine. Bow! 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 Okay, we're done with that. Bow! 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 Just imagining, like... Yeah, okay, you Can know... Can you animate a little... <laughs> you know when, like, you know when, like, around. 3D models just, like, find, like, kind of spin around, like, all all the bones of a 3D model just, like, spin around? Yeah, yeah. I mean rigging bones. And then, yes, like, I, I, I was I, just I, imagining, like, the Lazalfos <laughs> one from Ocarina of Time. <laughs> also, by the way... Like, spinning in on itself. That's all... The, I, future case, you can't do that, but, you know. <laughs> With how giggly we are, by the way, we'd like to say New Year's Eve, none of us have had any drinks yet. Just, yeah, just, yeah, that's just wanna, the best part. Want to yeah. state that? Yeah, this isn't like. We're, we're, I, I will later get drunk and play Yoshi's Story. We that's might have. A, we, we, <laughs> this might not be the only game we play tonight. Um, <laughs> what was that gonna? Fucking... Yeah, considering it's like what nine thirty. It is. It's ten. It's ten o'clock. <laughs> 10.30, whatever. It's 10.30. Whatever. Guys, whatever. guys. Time's uh, an enigma. This year's almost fucking over! Yeah, I was just Woo! gonna say, it's, it's, it's almost the end of 2020, which is, uh... Let's just, like, strap <laughs> in for, like, the beginning of 2021 and celebrate this being done. I, uh... This year being done, not the... Look at Asia's. She fucking I was, was re-watching our earlier episodes, and apparently Casey did the original voice for. Oh shit! Uh, no, you do a better one. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> I like that they do give you an option to warp out because that has literally helped us with recording in the past. And I feel like we've already talked about this, uh, but I like how after the first time, Link is like more he's familiar. Like, yeah. He's, he's like, like yeah. yeah, okay. He's like familiar with uh, with Uku now. So like, oh, yeah, it's you again. Don't they like appear in great numbers later in the game? <laughs> They yes, appear in great numbers. <laughs> Not in great numbers, but they appear. I honestly think the fact that that there is like that it isn't great numbers makes it funnier. 
It's not like there's a giant civilization. There's just, just like a, a few there's of just them, a like, couple around more about. It's like scattered. oh, well there there they are. <laughs> So, what, Ellie, what are we looking for here? <laughs> oh my god, okay, that's incredibly dangerous. <clears throat> Bring up your feet a little, Link. <laughs> Link, that would shatter Christ. all of your bones. <laughs> oh. You're like the one Thanks. thing standing between the world and, like, the the end of the world. So, like, come on, man. Those little, those Be little Be fucking enemies. careful. Have you, Ellie, have you played uh, Link Between Worlds? Yes. Uh, first of all, opinions. I love it. I fucking love that game. Too. I've, it I've, is that game was so fun. Oh, good. One of the best games on the 3DS. I've, um, I've started to play through recently, and I'm very early on still, but I need to, I need to keep playing it. Those those Metal Larion looking dudes were also in that game. I forgot. Yes, they were. Yes. That game is fucking fantastic. It's so fun. It's better than Link's Awakening on the Switch. It, like, it's a better top-down Zelda than that game. I have such a poor sense of direction in that game. Uh, it makes me feel really uh, bad because uh, I, I love that game <laughs> a lot. And I want to, like, progress, like but I'm so early on in it. Yeah, uh, I love no, it. No booties for you. And, like, one of my, so far my only opinion and takeaway I can give is that I feel like fucking Yuga's canonical voice should be Frieza. <laughs> That's it. All right, cool. Great That's contribution. It. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> no, no, you would love that game, man. That I do love so that game. Good. I'm just very... I, I used to try and play the, through it all every March from because the, it's a very March game. Um, okay. Yeah, I'm just feeling <laughs> it. Every March, I feel it. <laughs> every, every March, I feel the call of Yuga. Dread it. I feel the Run call from of it. Yuga. He's coming for Yuga me. arrives either way. Is Yuga a dude or a woman? He's a dude. He's a dude. He's... A dude. He's a very, a very feminine yes. man. I did think from the, I did, hot. man, okay, so for anyone who has played this game, I'm about to ruin, like, I'm about to make you all be like, oh, fucking, really? My first exposure to that game was someone play, okay. My first exposure to that game was someone playing the final boss fight of it right the fuck next to me and me seeing the, the ending of the game. Oh, yeah, you told like, me about that. <laughs> which to be, and just like, yeah, that, that was the first thing I saw. Yeah. It's like, oh. Well, the game's well, that's still neat. incredible. It's so fun! There's, like, a great number of things that I From did while playing. Like, a lot of the bosses in as the game are just who, not, like, related to anything else. As, the temples are great. As a person who has played a good uh, played a good number of Zelda games, including Wind Waker, Twilight Princess, and start, and a bit of Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask, the, like... From how little of like Live Between Worlds I've played so far, it is my second favorite Zelda game. Your first favorite is Breath of the Wild. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, no, it's um, it's it's incredible. Link Between Worlds is so good. I need it. I need, I, 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 I I still haven't finished Link's Awakening. It's it's You're doing the fine. side quest that the, the big fetch quest, right? Or is it like a main The big fetch game? quest is the... necessary, I think, for progression. Okay, okay. Which is stupid. I had to look up every part of that. I have no idea how to get the bananas. The bananas? That's where I'm stuck. Uh, I need like canned food or the something monkey. also. You, you go monkey. monkey. You go the monkey. Yeah, you guys thought that that wasn't coming back, but guess what game we're playing with kids? It's back again! Monkey! Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. um... Yeah, uh, that that is the canonical joke of the series. Yeah, also, um, no, <laughs> it's, it's true though. Go on. Um, no, yeah, you go to Monkey. Um, the Monkey that was like outside of the uh, outside of the castle area. You go to him. I don't even think I've made it to the castle area. No, it's like around the castle I, I area. Know where I am? I I, I haven't don't... played it in a while, to be fair. So like. Wait, no, 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 wait. You need to you give get... the banana to the monkey? No, 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 you get, yes, you have to give the banana to the monkey. You get yeah. banana from the man, uh, the crocodile man. Yeah, on the shore that's, side. that's where I'm stuck. Crocodile man needs, um, cans. dog food. He's like, I fucking love cans. And when you show him, like, you get the dog food from the person who owns the Bow Wow. I and fucking no. love no. dog food. I, I, I no. fucking love no. cans. No. There's some dog food. Chris, ah! you, think I'm, you think I'm over-exaggerating, but in the game, he's like, I, I have to collect all canned foods. You give it to him, and he's like, Christ, man! You have to get, if you don't give me that, I'm gonna fucking flip out! Like, it's, he doesn't say that, but he says that. I <laughs> and then he gives it, and, and he fucking throws it up in the air, and he's... Uh, hey, man, I, I'm looking for some bananas. I 
fucking love cans. He's like a nice dude otherwise. But like, what does he say? He says, if you don't, if you don't give me that can right now, I'm gonna like something. It's like akin to like flip out or something. It's really fucking funny. Like, I'm gonna fucking lose it. <laughs> yeah, I, I think he might actually say lose it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so that that's where you get the bananas from. <laughs> so anyway, right, here's all the salt folks. Like Ben Temple. <laughs> there, well, there I really wish he just fell further. <laughs> oh, I think it's better that he didn't. I think it's better that he just That he only up. fell a little bit. He's like gone a little bit into like the No, no, he it. died. <laughs> A, sta I mean, a sweeping die. statement that I made earlier today about Breath of the Wild that I still hold to on Breath of the Wild Link partic uh, in particular is the fact that he has ragdoll physics, which makes him objectively 100 times funnier than every other Link. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. accidentally it's... blowing yourself up in, in Breath of the Wild is like a game within itself. Yeah. <laughs> so... Chris, why, why don't we talk about my mom playing Breath of the Wild? Oh, so yeah. Like, oh, Actually, let's talk God. about your mom talking, playing Breath of the Wild next time on Bro High. Next time on Bro High. Because we got to do it next time on Bro High. Okay, friend. goodbye! Seven, 17 minutes. Wait, 16 minutes? Oh, Welcome back. 18 minutes. <laughs>